Louisiana is really different. <laughs> it's crazy. It's, um, people, people say that it's like a foreign country, even though you're still in the States. And that's kind of true in some ways. Like the food is way different. Really good, really good food, but usually spicy and usually different. Um, things like crawfish, jambalaya, gumbo, standard fare. People eat that all the time and like you, you catch on really quick like what all of those are but um, Like they they love their food like New Orleans, you know people people always talk about um, Like Like all the all the great food all the great things that happen in New Orleans and um, It's just like that's that's probably number one that's different the food, like the food is really great. Um, another thing is like they um, they love their music. Like they they have all kinds of music, and Louisiana is really just a big melting pot. Like there's <laughs> there's just all kinds of people, different kinds in different areas of Louisiana, and they all have different dialects of Southern or French mixed in or you know, like metropolitan, normal, you know, what we would hear. Um, and a lot of the people around where I served are really poor. And so they have um, a, a different approach to life than, than the educated, um, you know, upper or middle class white, you know, people that are, that live around Utah. Um, and, you know, that's not, that's not a bad thing but it's, it's a different culture than it would be here because um, they, they look at life differently. Um, and they, they're, they're really loyal and, and proud of who they are. Um, and you know, their life experiences and where that's gotten them. Um, Sometimes they rely on God and sometimes they don't like it just it depends like when when people go through hard hard times and you know Louisiana there are a lot of hard times because because it's so poor that they you know they can go either way